Now, we've all heard of uh, Coles to Newcastle. Well, this is something rather like that, but because we're bringing you the story of quail's eggs to Japan from the Cotswolds. A Midlands farmer is exporting 35,000 of them to the land where they've been a delicacy for more than 500 years. It started with just 100 quails four years ago. Now, 20,000 birds are laying at the rate of 84,000 eggs a week. The eggs destined for Japan are pickled in spiced vinegar and prepared for Christmas hampers in a variety of flavours, smoked tarragon, Worcester sauce. It's one of just two quail farms in the UK. This one near Winchcombe in the Cotswolds is supplying the Japanese with something they've prized for hundreds of years. It's uh, quite an achievement for us and for the company to export to Japan. Um, I think probably it's because it's a British label, um, it's a British product, um, but it does seem strange that it's a Japanese bird laying a British quail's egg, and now we're exporting these to Japan. <laughs> and then an egg, and then breadcrumbs over. The Japanese chef at the Murasaki restaurant in Cheltenham remembers quail's eggs from her childhood, but now she's trying them out on the menu for the first time. I like quail's egg, especially um, when it's fried quite like this. It's nice. Um, because it's a um, small size, um, children take it uh, as a bento box, which is Japanese style lunch box. And because it's small size, and it's just right size for the lunch box like this. And does it have a, a particular Japanese name, the dish? Uzura no tamago fry. Which means? Fried quail's egg in breadcrumb. <laughs> The link between the Cotswolds and the Japanese delicacy is further strengthened by the fact that at the Marsh Goose restaurant in Morton and Marsh, quail's eggs have been a favourite with customers for a number of years. Great treat. Don't happen very often. They're really nice. I enjoyed them tremendously. They were a delicacy, very delicious, maybe a bit fiddly if you have to peel them yourself. We use them a lot in the canapes, uh, which where we would hard boil them. We cook them for about three or four minutes in their shell peel them, uh, slice them in half and serve them with some tuna or, or some uh, saffron mayonnaise. Um, so very simple to cook uh, and very similar to a hen egg, only on a smaller scale. They're very prolific layers, more prolific layers than hens. In fact, they'll lay one egg a day, about 300 eggs in a lifetime. And the egg weighs a tenth of the bird's body weight. The bird only weighs about eight ounces. With a thousand quail's eggs hatching every week, the farm should have no difficulty keeping up with the demand from Japan. Mike Kilbane, Midlands Today, Gloucestershire.